Alright, welcome back. This is, I guess, the second half reaching sort of the third half towards the end. The cigar was maybe, it's hard to do it with one hand, but maybe a pinky length extra and that, that was the entire cigar's length. So I guess this could be considered a second half and once I reach the band, it'll a little bit before the band will be the third half. What can I say about this cigar? It's very mild, you know? It's not like a mild Connecticut, because in my opinion, some of the mild Connecticut's I smoked, um, they still have sort of flavor complexities here and there, you know? Like it goes from a fresh hay, to maybe like a cookie dough, to maybe a little bit of a, uh, you know, just various different flavors, maybe a little bit of white pepper or something like that, whereas this is a very mild smoke to me. Maybe maybe I'm just used to smoking lots of Maduros and a lot of medium strength and maybe uh, full strength, full body smoke, so this one isn't really doing it for me, but I could smoke like five of these in a row, people. Like, it's not strong. Not many flavor complexity. Like in the beginning, I got like a sort of a natural tobacco flavor. Then I got a little bit of a, not coffee, not coffee, but like maybe a, maybe like a chocolate chip cookie without the chocolate chips. If you get what uh, if you get what I mean, like just the the basic uh, cookie dough, you know, without the chocolate chips, it's kind of what I'm getting. But mediocre flavor complexity. It's just really, it's a really smooth smoke. Not harsh. Um, doesn't really linger on the palate. Doesn't really hit the palate. You know, like with the Maduros or the full bodies or even some of the mild Connecticut's or other mild smokes that I had like you still get a flavor that lingers on the palate whereas this you could drink like a, a maybe a soda or whatever and, and you'll neutralize all the flavors this is a type of cigar that would be good paired with like white tea or something something very light and inoffensive because if you get anything stronger than that if you get like a coca-cola or um, something like that it's gonna overpower the flavors maybe even a sierra mist or a sprite might even overpower the flavors that's why i said like a very light white tea would probably be ideal for this i'll smoke the rest of these maybe it'll surprise me in the third half but Nothing groundbreaking, nothing major. For two dollars, I can't complain. The burn is still nice. You know, I didn't have to touch it up. It's not 100% straight, but it's burning fine. This is kind of a smaller cigar, so lengthwise at least, so the ash kind of falls off a bit quick. One more puff, and then I'm gonna get get into another vid and then to another video for the third half yeah nothing special guys so far do I recommend it meh I'd smoke them again I wouldn't make them a favorite I wouldn't make them a daily um, maybe a summertime smoke this would be an okay summertime smoke if you want something inoffensive This is the Fumas Rosadas, I think. Rosadas, I believe. Because there's also a Fumas Natural, I think. Or maybe even a Maduro. I don't remember. But this is the Rosadas. Not bad for two bucks, but... The, the cigar that I smoked for one dollar, the Canuco, actually had more flavor complexities than this cigar. Which is hilarious. Because that one's a dollar. This one's like two dollars. So... 
It depends what flavors you like. I like the flavors of the Canuco better than I kind of like the flavors of this. If you're a if you're a newbie to cigars and if you want something really offensive or if you're trying to get a girl like to smoke cigars or whatever, I'd say go with this. It's a small cigar. It's only two dollars. If they don't like it, they could always toss it. It's good for stuff like that. But if if you're an experienced cigar smoker already and you want some flavor complexities and you want you know you want to feel like you're smoking a good quality cigar, you want to taste all those different things. Maybe you want to pair it with some coffee or whatever. Don't go for this cigar. You know. It's just a plain smoke, plain smoke, minor, very minor twists in flavor, but nothing to write home about. Anyway, see you in the third half.